Hello peeps, welcome back to Dust, an Elysian Tale. It's been a little while since i played any of this, so I'm probably going to be a little bit rusty to begin with. Um, last we left off we'd spoken to a vendor, and uh, let's see if we can see one of those fruit things up there. Can we knock that off? Oh, oh. Okay. Uh, oh, do we need that or something? Which way should we go? Should we go this way? This way seems to be a good way to go. Oh. Maybe not. Maybe I should have gone the other way. Should I go back? I think I'm going to go back. Come on, Fidget. Let's go back the other way. Ah, so I need to get that. I need to get that bomb thing all the way down there. That's quite a long way to go. Ah! No, come on. No, 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 no. Not quite. Okay. Let's try again. Not sure how the best way to do this is. Does it come back? It's, uh, I think that's, uh, that sound indicated it'd come back. Well, I'm How am I going to get it down there? Hmm. Okay, this is a bit of a puzzle. I can get it to this distance, but I can't get it down the hole. I can't, can I see? No, I can't see what's, what's down there. Hmm. Alright, let's have another go. I don't want to spend too long doing this. Oh. No, 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 no. Oh. Get it. I'm sure there's uh, an easier way of doing it, and I just can't figure it out. Maybe I'll figure it out later. I'll come back and try again. Hmm. Wonder if I can. Can I? No. Dust, there's something up there. Not a problem at all. Stand back. All right, I've got it. Wait, no. Ah. The hell? Having some trouble there? Yeah, I don't know. I just can't get a good enough grip. Ah, you're just trying to show off. That's sweet. Don't worry about it. I'm sure there's a way to get up there. We'll just come back later. Hmm. Ok, 
Okay, well. Whoa. Ow. Take that. Nope. <laughs> Don't attack the deer. Ah, are we, are we at the village? Looks like we're heading in the right direction. Ah. Be on your guard, Dust. I sense a powerful foe ahead of you. Oh, good. Don't worry, Dust. I'll be behind you every step of the way. Way behind. Oh. What? <laughs> it's another one of those... That noise is me <laughs> trying to hit it. <laughs> Their persistence, I'll give them that. Ooh, they're horrible, slimy, as I teethy this things. Corrupted beast. Now might be a good time to demonstrate the parry technique. What? Allow it to strike. The hell? Hey, you dazed it! Attack and hold the button at the moment of the enemy strike, and you will parry their attack, opening them up for a counterattack. Hmm. Timing is crucial, and you must be facing your opponent. And as you can see, a successful parry may also daze your opponent temporarily. Now, put this beast out of its misery. Hold X to parry an incoming enemy attack with one of your own. Immediately follow up with X or Y for a powerful counter. Okay. I'll, I'll try. Nah, look at all the cute adorable bodies. Look at them. <laughs> okay. Oh. I see somebody over there. <laughs> it's right I in front of you. They've got anything to eat. We're in a bit of a hurry, Fidget. Don't worry. I'll feed you later. Hey, I'm not a pet. But, uh... I would appreciate that. Thanks. Oh dear. They don't look very happy, do they? Oh, hello! You surprised me there. Don't get many travelers this far out of town. Sorry about that. It's nice to finally meet a friendly face. So, we're getting closer to the village then? You mean Aurora Village? Yes. It's just beyond those fields to the east. And I think you might be just in time. What do you mean? The monster attacks down there have been getting worse. Right before you showed up, I'd swear I heard somebody shouting. Oh, no. She's right, Dust. I can hear somebody calling for help further down the path. Let's get going. Yes, please hurry. Be careful. Thanks. Uh, oh, what is, is it? Yes, it's that one. Figured I should probably heal up a little bit. Depending on your difficulty level, save monuments will also restore some of your health. Alright. Let's, uh, save then while we're here. Didn't actually notice if that restored any of my health or not. Dramatic music. Bunnies! What are they doing? Look! Please! Help us! <laughs> oh. Oh. Okay. Ah! Look at the size of that thing! That's what she said. Don't worry. I think I can handle it. Exercise all you've learned, Dust. Send these foul creatures from this existence. I actually died. No, wait! That's not all of them! Here comes some more! It's good about. Whoa, okay. Oh. Oh, I can't 
Jesus, what's going on? <laughs> okay. Is that it? Whew. Did we get all of them? <sighs> yeah, I think that's it. Well done. That was pretty Dust. intense. You have proven yourself a worthy swords master, and none too soon. Bah, they weren't so tough. I could probably take on another four or five of them. You know, if I had to. And this was there. Oh, thank you so much. What happened here? I, I don't know. We were out here checking the fields when those giants attacked. We've been having a lot of problems with smaller beasts, but this is the first time a giant has ever come this close to the village. Then the first step of your journey is near its end dust. The village lies just ahead. Hooray! Yes, we arrived. That's great. But what now? That has not yet been revealed to me. These people are safe, and that is what is important. Let us continue onward. Will you two be all right? Yes, I just need a moment to rest. I'm not sure how you did it, but you took down three giants single-handedly. Not a problem. That's what we do. Bringing justice to the weak and defenseless. Hey, who are you calling weak? <laughs> yeah, legit. All right, let's, um, we've got to level up, so let's have us Let's increase max health, I think. Uh... Yeah. Yeah. Okay, good. Oh, and um have we Did we pick anything else up? Uh we got some keys. Oh, let's put that on. Let's put that on. Still only got one of them and We've got blueprints for that one. Cool. Okay. Good. So that's where all those bunnies are going, coming from. From those two villages. Well, that's cool. Chapter 1. Destiny. Hmm. This is the village then, I guess. Aurora Village. It looks quite nice. Quite oriental in its style from that uh, image. Well, apart from these. Oh, hello. Hold it right there. Uh, are they gone? I don't hear anything. <laughs> if you're referring to the giants, I took care of them. They're dead? Yep. Thoroughly expired. They were no match for us. There's an older couple back there that could use some help, though. That must have been Oneida and her husband, Gian. Thank you. I, we'll send help right away. So you're saying you just happened to show up at the right time, huh? I suppose. Interesting coincidence. If you're suggesting I had something to do with this attack... Whoa, whoa, take it easy. I, I have to apologize for my big friend, Calum, here. We're just a little overwhelmed, is all. What's been happening here? I guess you missed the endless hordes of bloodthirsty monsters on your way in? They used to stay in the mountains, away from the village. Now, they're attacking us on a daily basis. No one's been hurt yet, uh, at least not until today. If giants are showing up near Oneida's farm, things are far worse than we thought. Speaking of which, where exactly do you come from? There's nothing west of here except crazy old Korra. We're, uh... Prospectors! We are prospectors! And we're out on an excavation to find, uh, ore deposits in the mountains! You know, gold, silver, um, manganite? Prospectors, eh? <laughs> You're certainly well armed for the job. Like you said, there are a lot of monsters out there. <sighs> well, we're indebted to you either way, so go on through. But I'm watching the two of you. Please, make yourselves at home. Uh, my name is Bean. There's Bean. not much here, but we do have a Mr. merchant who needs supplies. Bean. Thank you. We'll be on our way then. Thanks. A new region has been revealed. 
Ugh, another cutscene. Spectres, fidgets, that was the best thing you could come up with? It was the first thing that popped into my head. It's not like you had anything better. Come on, let's get away from these guards. Yes, and it's... All right, Ara. Where to now? You're right where you need to be. The answers <laughs> to your identity lie somewhere in this village. Well, can we get out of the rain? I know this oh, place. Oh, stop around. That's so. for certain. I'm sure I've been here before, but or is it? nobody Maybe seems not. to recognize me. And you, in turn, do not recognize them. Yet I feel there is something here that may yet trigger your memory's return. Maybe we should look around for a bit, then? If you really have been here before, maybe somebody will recognize you. That is a good idea, Fidget. Let us meet with the townspeople. I am certain that the next step of your journey will reveal itself in time. Very well. But something... something here is making me uneasy. Like the calm before a storm. Well, maybe it is, is the actual storm. Maybe. Oh, hi. Uh, speak to this guy. Why, hello there. I'm always thrilled to see a new face. Even when it's all covered up like yours. Indeed. Well, my name is Dust, and this is Fidget. Hiya! Don't mind Mr. Grumpy. He's not big on the whole eye contact thing. Fidget and Dust, eh? Not from around here, are you? Well, neither was I originally. But this is a nice little place, if you're not in a hurry. Ah, oh, where are my manners? I'm Augustine, local strongman. Say, you want to arm wrestle? Uh, some other time, perhaps. We're just passing through. Ah, oh, that's a shame. Thought you looked like the arm wrestling type. You know, I heard what you did back there for Oneida. Great stuff. Maybe we can help each other out? Maybe. Maybe. <laughs> what did you have in mind? I have an old friend, a blacksmith. Lives way up at the top of Archer's Pass. I promised I'd deliver some materials to him way back when. But haven't been up that way in ages. Well, it's not a very nice pretty promise, dangerous then, is it? these days, if you ask me. Maybe you could deliver them for me? Sure. Tell you what, if you help me out, I'll give you this blueprint. If you give it to him along with these spare materials, he'll set you on your way right quick. A blacksmith that can craft items from blueprints? I think I'll take you up on that, Augustine. Wow, that's great! I knew I could count on you! When you see him, just tell him that old Augustine says hello. I mean, old. You don't look old. You look about 17. Okay, so we've got another quest to speak to. Right, let's speak to this guy, Gianni. Jess? Uh, good morning? Hmm. <laughs> Is it though? I. well, I guess. He guesses. Wonderful. Well, perhaps you can guess that I really don't want to talk such drivel right now. Go, scurry off and leave me be. <laughs> Good. <laughs> Thanks, Gianni. Been very helpful. Hello, Mosca. Let's speak to Mosca as well while we're here. Hello. I don't believe I've seen you before. We just came in from the west. Ah, oh, so you're the one everyone is talking about. Everyone's talking? Of course! You're the one who saved Oneida! Uh, my name is Mosca, and I am at your service. If you need anything, just let me know. Uh... Say, are you, uh... Are you staying long? I don't know. Why do you ask? Well, if you ever find yourself heading east of the village, maybe you could let me know if the roads are safe? Oh, they're far from safe. The town guards mentioned that monsters have been attacking all sides of the village. You're better off staying inside the walls for now. Well, see, here's my problem. Mm -hmm. I've been meaning to visit someone in Denim. Mm -hmm. It's a small village on the edge of Abadi's forest. I imagine this someone is pretty important to you? Well, yeah. See, it's about a girl. Wow, she really <laughs> I thought you were a girl. <laughs> oh, she is. She With a weird is. voice. I just... Because you're like I, I want to make sure she's okay. Stuff. With all and these monsters around, there's girl. been no word from Denim at all. Mosca, if my travels take me there, I'll let her know you're thinking about her. Oh, thank you so much. You're great. You're really, really great. Yeah. Can I get up there? No. 
Okay. What do we reckon? Down or up? Oh. Let's go up briefly. Ah, oh, hello. You, you're perfect. Um, thanks. Not you. Listen. Do you hear it? Can you hear its whispers locked within? Within the box. My box. I um. don't hear anything. <laughs> well, of course you don't. My box has been lost. Somebody must have stolen it. Perhaps it was that Mosca fellow. He's always averting his gaze from me. Like he's hiding something. Probably his distaste for your nuttiness. I can hear its whispers coming from below. Down, deep down in the earth. If you're ever down there, please, you must find my box and return it at once. And whatever you do, do not open the box. Okay, well, now I want to open if the I box. find if your I box find underground, it. I'll be sure to bring it back. And open it to have a look. Find out what's inside. Because, you know, now you said don't open it. I kind of want to open it. Oh, hello. Hi there. Well, hello. Oh. Ah. Uh, you're a quiet one. Dust, manners. You'll have to excuse him. He's a bit worn out, saving the village and everything, you know? Yes, I heard something about that. Ah, uh, yes. Well, good. Honestly, it doesn't matter. They'll just keep coming back. I... And there's nothing we can do about it. Excuse me. Wow. What a downer. Her name is Ginger. Okay. She's a cheerful one, huh? A bit of gratitude might have been nice. What kind of a bratty... Hey, ease off, Dust. She looked like she was pretty depressed. I... I don't know why I said that. I'm sorry, Fidget. I... I don't know what came over me just then. Come on, let's keep moving. Hmm. There's obviously some kind of connection between those two. Uh, but I don't know what it is. Um, let's bypass her. Let's go and do the... Let's bypass him as well, because he's crazy. And we'll have a look down here. Maybe this guy's box is down here, somewhere. Oh. Okay. Whee! Lots of stuff. Oh, was that a new ring? I picked up C cinnamon bun and a blue mushroom smooth ring. Sweet. So I've got a smooth ring there and a dull ring there. Cool. So it's that defense and luck. Attack, defense and luck. Nice. Modify. I'm not sure how to, to do that. That's fine. Cool. Good. I think I might have to... Um... Oh. <laughs> not that button. I think I might have to change this to something else. Uh, cinnamon buns to 100 health. Cool. Uh, only got... Right, let's equip the tasty cupcakes. Well, continue on. Mm, more treasure in this area. This is a vendor. It is ah our famed savior. I had hoped you'd come. Welcome to my humble shop. Hello. Hello there. What is this? Chal... Chaldubagi? Pork with rice wrapped in a fresh leaf of lettuce. 120 health. Oh, that's very nice. But um, I think we'll just... Um, let's just buy... Let's buy a couple of those. And... Uh, what else we got? Hmm. I 
I have one of those already. I have the best one already. And same with that. Okay, so let's switch to cell mode. Um, can I? Oh, I don't actually have any. Okay. A giant rock. Is it used for anything? I don't think so. I don't know. I don't. Really, honor us I don't really want to sell anything because I don't know if I. I think I might have balls that up a bit. Oh, I've leveled up. Okay, that was a bit. That was a surprise. Um. Let's put it in there. Oh, let's um, get this first. Okay, now we'll talk to her. Hello. Oh, hi. You're new. Are you travelers? Maybe you can help me? I can't find my little brother, Corbin. He's not in the village? No, he's not here. I can't find him, and I've looked absolutely everywhere. Don't worry, I'll keep an eye out for him. What's your name? My name is Colleen. Oh, I wonder if he left the village. He could get hurt. Uh oh. Calm down, Colleen. I'll look for him. Where did you see him last? I think he was doing something for Mr. Gianni, but whenever I ask him about Corbin, he says he's too busy. I really don't like that guy. Gianni, huh? Okay, wait here. If you find Corbin, please bring him home. I'm really getting worried about him. Okay. Well, you should probably not, uh, be stood out in the rain. So, we should go and speak to Gianni, who is right back the other direction. Excuse me. Oh, hang on. Did I just pick up something? So two attack, two luck. Two attack, four defense, one luck. Four defense f in exchange for one luck. I think we should probably wear that. Okay, do I get anything else? Ooh. Cool. Cool. Uh, no, that's Reed. Need to find Gianni. You're not Gianni. Gianni's the one with the mustache. Ah, there we go. Gianni, I want to ask you about a boy named Corbin. Ah, have you seen him? Where has that foolish boy run off to? I was hoping you could tell me. He must still be wasting time in Ivydale Glen. I just knew I shouldn't have trusted that boy with cleaning my fabrics. Corbin is doing your laundry outside the village? I do not see why this is so difficult to comprehend. But then I suppose you don't have the capacity for rational thought. If you are so concerned, maybe you should go look for him instead of waffling about. Wow. Oh, I'll find him. Then we're going to have a little chat. Right. Uh. Okay. I, I guess it's back this way then. I, I don't really know. Can I get down there? No. Can I go up there? No. Okay. Off we go. Da -da 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 -da. Gonna go and save Corbin, and we're gonna find treasure. And, uh, oh, hang on, we've already found treasure. Does that mean is there more treasure? Oh, 
Here we go. A note, a word of advice. Oh, and there's one here as well called Reed's Box, which I didn't see. Box. That's what it is. It's a box. You can't open it. Don't look in the box. Do not open the box. You can look at the box, but that's it. And only if it helps you bring it back. It fell into a hole near the storage cave in Aurora. No doubt found by whatever lives in the darkness deep below. Good. Okay, word of advice. What is this thing? Some kind of cage? Whatever it is, it's making this awful, awful racket. Once in a while I hear the words... I hear words that sound like fat and beats. What does that even mean? Fat beats, man. It's all about the fat beats. I'll hide it in the caves beneath Aurora until I've found the keys I need. I just need to remember to jump as far to the right as I can. Hmm. Let's quickly uh, save. Jump as far to the right as I can. Wait, so am I supposed to do that down there? That's left. Hmm. Not sure about this. Okay. Let's speak to this guy. Good day. I'm Mayor Bram. Hello, Mayor so Bram. So you're the hero I've been hearing about. Apparently. It's nothing, really. We're just passing through. No need to be modest, my friend. We can't thank you enough for your help. Things have been rough in Aurora of late, so having a true hero in our midst is really boosting morale. So what's your name, son? Dust. My name is Dust. And some of the villagers I've met, they don't seem quite as pleased as you. Ah, are you talking about the Watchmen? You must understand, hardly a day goes by without some monstrosity attacking our peaceful village. They were simply being cautious. Take my word, I'm sure they meant no ill will. And there was also this girl. Yes, that could only be Ginger. She can be a bit of a handful, but don't pass judgment on her like that. You have no idea what she's gone through this past year. She looked pretty upset about something. Don't concern yourself. We have other matters to discuss. What help could I possibly provide? A few giants in a field seem like the least of your problems. Yet again with the modesty. You're no mere travelers, that much I've gathered. Mineral merchants don't wield blades as impressive as yours, Dust. Please, we really could use the help. I don't know. I'm searching for something myself. Then perhaps we can help each other. If you help our village, I promise I'll do whatever I can to help you. But I can be of no assistance while our village is constantly attacked by these creatures. We suspect their leader is close by, and if you could... Whoa, whoa, whoa. You hold on a second. You're saying those mindless thugs have a leader? Until recently, they would attack us in small groups. Nothing we couldn't handle. Now, they coordinate attacks on a much larger scale, hitting the village on both sides, driving our forces apart. I assure you, whatever leads these things is experienced in warfare. Well, that doesn't sound good. What do they want? Our land, I imagine. Just a casual observation, but they don't seem the farming type. Well, whatever it is, it's become a serious problem. If you truly are as capable as I hear... You want us to find their leader? It certainly would cripple their advance. You'll be doing the entire village a great service. How about it, Dust? Well, I... You feel a conflict of emotions. This is good. I will abide by your decision, Master. I trust you to take the right path. Helping this village is the right thing to do. But it's more than that. It's almost like... Like I know these people. Like I have to help them. I think that strange feeling you've got is a little foreign concept called compassion. I'm proud of you, Dust. Of course, if you said no, I'd need to bite your face off. <laughs> Charming as always, Fidget. I think you've made a wise decision. All right, Mayor Bram, you've convinced us. We'll do what we can to help stop these attacks. <laughs> That's my boy. The Watchmen reported increased monster activity to the east of our village, so I imagine that's where you should go. 
But do be careful. Strong as you may be, I've seen many fine warriors lose their lives to these monstrosities. I understand, Mayor. I'll be careful. And I'll be back. I'll be back. Uh. Right, well, I think that's uh, a good place to, uh, to stop. Um, I'm just going to run back to the save point and save it. Um, I shall thank you for watching. Lots of story in this uh, particular episode. And um, we shall continue next time.